Hello fellow monsters, Sticker Monster here, and today we are going to be playing Resident Evil 7, The Beginning Hour. This is the demo for the new Resident Evil coming out. I have no idea besides what I saw at the E3 um, live stream, but I saw a little bit of it and I was like, holy balls, this is going to scare the fuck out of me, so let's do this. Alright. I got it as dark in here as I can get it without, um, you know. The green screen. I couldn't think about it. The green screen. Fucking up. Okay, I do not have any save files. I just got off work and I was finally able to download it. I was going to upload it this morning and record it this morning and all that stuff. But unfortunately, I was not able to considering the fact that I had to go to work and be an adult. So, you know. That's a problem. The light's orange. In case you guys were wondering, it's an orange light. Resident Evil 7. <sighs> Creepy as ball. <sighs> Get out of the house. Okay, wait, this is not what we saw. I shall dash them against the stone. Why? Why shall you do that? Hello, creepy man. Hello, books. Oh, you can't pick anything up? Hey, white noise. What you shut the fuck up? I don't have a videotape. What? Um, I thought this was a zombie apocalypse, not ghost in a house. The balls? Okay, what is this? A fuse is missing. I can fix that. Okay, not too creepy. I've seen- what is this? I've seen creepier. I'm really, really excited to share this experience with you guys. Why did I have to push X to open a fucking door? I don't know to... Hello? Can I lean? No. I can do something with triangle. Hello? For you guys. And we'll do this for you guys. Because I love you guys. And I love Resident Evil too, so... I'm so happy they're bringing the scare factor back, but I'm, I didn't expect... Oh, well, that's not terrifying at all. I didn't expect it to be this way. Because, I mean, it's first-person view, and I just, I don't understand why it would be a dummy finger. What the fuck do I need a dummy finger for? Check inventory. Part of a dummy hand made of celluloid. It's made of people? Is that what that's saying? Okay. I, I'm trying to make sure I get through this so you guys can see the whole thing, but I'm also so fucking scared because I'm a little puss, so... <gasps> oh, Well, that's not fucking cool. Why would you do that? Okay, so this part I saw in E3. You open the lid, and you're like, Oh, God, that's disgusting, and then you're like, Oh, fuck, there's a cockroach! Could you guys imagine that with the VR? This is VR compatible, so... I'm really excited to see where that goes. I want to get a VR, but I am I'm a broke motherfucker. And then if I remember right when you walk in this direction. Nothing happened. That's weird. I thought something happened in E3 when that when that thing went off. 
My heart is beating a million miles an hour. I haven't played a good horror game in a long time. So I'm just so nervous to see what would happen. Why am I doing this? Why am I doing this? Why am I doing this? Hey, bolt cutters! Oh, fuck you, dude! You fucking ugly ass little bitch ass fucking doll! Look at that! You, you have a crack in your butt! And not the normal crack in your butt that you're supposed to have! The fucking. You're stupid ass bitch. Oh, okay, there's nothing behind me. That is disgusting. Fucking disgusting. Nobody, nobody wants that. Okay. Hello? Excuse me. I'm just gonna continue with what I'm doing. Oh, is something gonna pop out? Something gonna pop out? These way things pop out! Ooh. Okay, nothing popped out. That is a rusted ass can. Excuse me! Did I ask you? No, I didn't. But I do have a tape. Okay. And I'm not going upstairs. I will go upstairs if I need to. Did I fucking ask you? Okay. Now we should be safe in here, I'm assuming. I'm hoping. Okay, and then go there. What is this? Derel De Derelict house June 1st. Dolby haunted house rehearsal. Abandoned house. Ooh. Hey! Shut up! Where did you find this guy? Give me a break, Pete. Hey, I only work with professionals. Speaking of which, make sure the sound is right this time. I don't want a repeat of Amarillo. That was two fucking years ago. I don't do ADR. Oh, I actually have to walk. I'm not feeling it. Again? Just don't be surprised if we have to make a change. Why is that guy being such an asshole to me? plan. We do a walkthrough of the inside first, then we shoot the intro. Just like we always do. Just try to say the show's name this time, okay? No problem. Tonight on Sewer Gators, another worthless fucking shithole. Happy? Static. Why is that guy... The, the, in Resident Evil or any kind of horror game, you always get that one guy that's a stuck-up prick, and I hope he's the first one to die. I really, really do. Are we rolling? Yes, we're rolling. Right, Hello? <clears throat> Get out of the way. <clears throat> it's locked. Well, I guess not anymore. Good job, man! High five! So, why are we in hell this time? Do you ever prep? What's the prep? Shitty house, spooky sounds. Ooh, is it haunted? I don't know, this house... Fuck me. I was an anchor, you no know? No one cares! You can sub, Pete. Not anchor. What's that? Nothing. What's the story, Andre? Abandoned farmhouse, missing family, foul play suspected. Okay. The usual. How is that the usual? How long did you say this place has been abandoned? Three years. <coughs> Clancy, get a shot of this. Let's make a great cutaway. So, uh... Hillbilly Joe and his family go missing. Not hillbillies, the Bakers. Jack and Marguerite Baker. Oh. And they were quiet, not backward. A lot of bad rumors about their son, Lucas. Bad seat, apparently. Their son was an asshole, then. From what ah, he shit. said. I know I should have worn my good shoes. Well, you're a dumbass. Oh, shit. Glad I had my shots. Although, this would make a great backdrop. Andre, what do you think? Andre? He did get rather Andre. quiet. Where did he go? Andre! Clancy, you see where Andre went? Where is he? Unfucking believable Ooh. This is the last time- Well, I how did you not see that? I mean, producers, they come and go, but uh, 
A good cameraman like you, Clancy? You stick with me. Oh, now he's a little pussy ass bitch. I'm not look. Okay, I'm gonna look back. Is there anything back there? No? Okay. Andre! Come here, baby. What the fuck was that? Did open it. That? Op open it. Open it! Open! Andre? Where the fuck is he? So I'm assuming this is how this all started then, and that's why we would be in Andre, this room when you, I woke man? up. <clears throat> but it's Resident Evil, so I'm assuming it would be about zombies, right? And where does this take place on the timeline? What the hell? You gotta be fucking kidding me. Oh, secret passageway. Lovely. Alright, new deal. We, we find Andre and we go. I mean, fuck this show. You little pussy ass bitch. The atmosphere, the atmosphere is fucking amazing. That's for sure. Oh, I can stand back up. Like, it's not like every other game I played. Oh no, at least it gives you some kind of direction. You first. <laughs> Need a nice hero oh, shot of me I'm not comfortable. coming down the ladder. So, uh... You first. You fucking little bitch. Okay. Jingle, 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 fell with down a long ladder. What do you see? What I don't it? see a single fuck. Are you gonna come down here? Cause I don't wanna be down here by myself. Andre, hey buddy. Hi. Oh, you're dead, aren't you? Oh, dude, dude. What the fuck happened? He was gone for three seconds. Oh, who are you? Ooh, do you have anything to do with umbrella co 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 comparison? The comp, comp. The comp, comp. The comp. Okay, anyways, you. What the fuck happened? I shall dash you against the stone. Oh. So now we're gonna turn this around on me. Okay. This is fucking horrifying. I am terrified right now. Literally, full force fucking terrified. I can't leave. Should I go upstairs? That's not normal. What the fuck is this? Stairs. Woo, mannequin! Dark. Oh, the mannequins are looking at me. Can you not? Can you really just not? Oh, go away! I don't like mannequins. Oh, fuck you! I'm gonna leave. I'm not looking back. I'm not. I'm not gonna look back. I'm just. I don't like mannequins. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't fucking like mannequins. Okay, it's still daylight. Remember, it's still daylight outside. So, that's a plus. I'm definitely getting a very strong PT. Um, 
feel kind of concerned why they went in this direction no i i feel like they went in this direction because they saw how successful silent hills would have been and um they they might have wanted to go into a different and um let let's see if i can go down the uh, the ladders even though i really 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 don't want to Okay, here we go. Why would I do this? I mean, I saw what happened. Why would I want to come back here? Like, there should be another way out of here than to go down this long-ass ladder going... Doop, 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 doop. I can leave! Oh, I can't even go downstairs. Okay. Okay. <sighs> Thank God. Okay. I am so ready to get the fucking pants scared off of me right now. Oh, fuck you! Fuck you! Fuck you! That's not normal! Inner peace. Inner I don't want to do this anymore! <laughs> Can I run? Can I just fucking go? Is that a thing? Can I just leave? Ah! Ooh, you motherfucker. I'm going. I'm nothing fucking stopping me now. You can go fuck yourself. That's for goddamn sure. <laughs> Welcome to the family. <gasps> son. You son of a bitch. What the fuck is going on? We gotta get the hell out of here. So it's more than just this zombie shit. This guy is actually fucking psycho. Come on. No, there's zombies. Okay. Interesting. Very interesting. I wasn't expecting that. Is there more to the demo, or is that it? Is that it? The family is expecting you early 2017. Open the door to Resident Evil Ambassador Program. Hashtag RE7. So that's it, then. And then I think it just continues to where you were at. Yeah, it just continues to, uh, the beginning. That was very interesting. And the reason I say that is because I love horror games. I love first-person horror games. I love everything about them. You know, that... It, horror games. You know, I fucking love it. But Resident Evil... This Resident Evil demo is bringing something new to the table. And I can imagine... Okay. I can imagine how a lot of the old players are feeling... They're like, okay, well, you know, that's not like old school Resident Evil. That's like, you know, what what the fuck is going on? They're trying to rip off PT or Allison Road or something like that. But then you get a lot of the newer fans and we're like, well, I'm I'm an older fan and a newer fan. I'm, I'm My mind is 100% open for change. The old side of me is like, it's not the original. The new side of me is like, this can be absolutely fucking terrifying because they're finally bringing back the scare factor. And... That's something that Resident Evil lost. I uh, was it after Nemesis or was it Code Veronica? It was one of the two. But after one of the two, it's just the scare factor went to shit. Resident Evil Four was like, eh, this is kind of scary, you know, some some creepy moment. And then Resident Evil Five, Resident Evil Six, Operation um, Raccoon City, you know, all that stuff. It, it really lost its scare factor, and it, it's nice to see the company coming back in that direction. But it's also disappointing to see that it's not going to be the third person kind of atmosphere that we're used to like do we even get a gun in this are we going to get guns are we going to be able to buy health you know pick up ammo like 
figure out puzzles or is it just going to be like the PT demo was and just you're going to walk around and activate shit? Because PT was supposed to be a lot more than that, but we didn't get to see it because unfortunately it was canceled. But with the Resident Evil 7 demo that I just saw, I really hope that's not it. Because if that's all it's going to be, I'm going to play it. I love horror games and you guys know that, so I'm obviously going to play it. But I'm going to be, like, emotionally destroyed at the same time while emotionally excited because, like I was explaining, awesome horror game, not, do you know, not like Resident Evil. But I, I'm, I'm excited all together to see what this game's going to turn into. If I can, if I end up getting enough money to get a virtual um, reality headset for the PS4, I will more than likely do that. I would love to get a VR for... My computer, but I know my computer won't be able to handle it, so I'd have to do the, um, you know, the PS4 headset. But, I don't know, I'm excited. I'm really, really, really excited to see where this goes. Let me know what you guys think about it. Me, Besides me being a little bitch, I get really scared at horror games. And I think that's why you guys like when I play them, because the smallest sound can creep me the fuck out. But, I'm gonna, uh, I want to know what you guys think about it. So... Thank you guys for watching. I really appreciate it. If you guys like this video, finger that like button for me. And remember, when there's a shout, the monster's out.